Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Life as Tiff Knows It. Tiff here bringing you an unboxing. I'm so excited. I just received this particular diamond painting um, a couple days ago and it's been downstairs in my living room. I've been just looking at it. Really excited to film this today. So let's go ahead and get in it. This is, I believe, a kit from Craft Ease. So Craft Ease. I have ordered from before let's just check yes definitely crafties they have some other orders coming in from diamond art club um or they already have came in but i just wanted to make sure it was a while ago that i ordered this i'm so excited i ordered i didn't order it my mom did for my my birthday this is a birthday gift to me i'm so excited i have no idea when i'm going to get this done but I'm very excited about it. So I really like the packaging on here from Crafty's Diamond Painting Kit. Uh, how is Crafty's different? We actually promote independent artists and collaborate with them by re what re remunerating them for hard work. I don't know. I am. I just had a massage, so I'm feeling like uh, I have massage brain and I cannot understand what that word is <laughs> um anyway this looks so good crafties.com I like looking at like kind of the packaging in the front so check out our guide canvas color diamonds tray applicators tweezers and gums which would be wax shall we get into it shall we see what I got this has been on my want list for years, for at least two years, I believe. So, here's the canvas itself. Is there anything else in this box? No, there is not. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'll have to see if it's in frame and I'll have to adjust if not. Before we get to the canvas, before I do the reveal, actually, no, I'll show you. Um, this is, this is the image right here. It is a glow in the dark jellyfish. This is going to be perfect for my office. So I have at work, my office is all under the sea themed. I love jellyfish. I think they're such cool creatures. And so I just could not resist. I could not resist working on this kit. I might actually have students help me with it, even though that makes me slightly nervous, but we we shall see so let's go ahead i keep changing my mind but we'll get into let's do the canvas first because i'm just so excited to see it oh my gosh you guys look at all those colors here i'm gonna roll it the other way kind of straighten it out let's see here can i get it all in frame pause I'm gonna I'm gonna zoom out a little bit so you can see it a little better okay, hopefully that is a little better there is definitely the reflection from the light coming in but yeah it, that reflect it's kind of glaring the light is <laughs> um look how beautiful this is I'm trying to lift it up so you can see a little bit better oh I love it I love it I love it so um size wise does it say the size on here it does. It is a 45 by 55 centimeter kit. Um, it is a round kit. When I look at the drill field itself, it's very clear. Lots of color blocking. Oh, I'm sorry about the glare. Lots of color blocking. Um, this whole background is going to be, I'm hoping black instead of like a 934, but like a, I'm wanting a 310 because I love black the um drill field itself is very clear like if i show you here you can see super clear which is nice it does sometimes these kits throw me off because it looks as if it's a square drill kit but that is just the um way that the kit is made oh my gosh i'm so excited for this the um material itself does kind of have like a felt background to it but it's not like velvety soft 
which I actually personally prefer. It does have the scalloped edges, so you don't have to worry about fraying, which is nice. Um, I'm a little bit surprised, like the ink itself is not super saturated. I was just working on a um, Mary Simon's kit, I think, that has, um, is it Mary's Di it's not Mary's Diamonds, Dreamer Designs, that is very saturated. So this is not, like when I put it up to the light, it looks very um, light, which is not a problem because you can see the symbols so well. When we're looking at the symbols themselves, I do like that there's a variety here. I like that there's a heart. I haven't actually worked on a diamond painting where one of the symbols is a heart, so that's kind of cool. Lots of letters involved, and I don't know what the co if the colors mean they're special drills. We'll look at the drills to find out. So there's 25 colors in this kit. Oh my gosh, I just am so excited. I love it, love it, love it. Um, and it's a manageable size. Like I like this size for sure. Uh, let's see the stickiness of the canvas. Oh yeah, that definitely has some stick. The stick does go around all of this border here. I do remember that with crafties. So definitely a kit that you're gonna most likely want washi tape if you don't want to get like the icky sticky stuff on it. So let's go ahead and bust into the drills. It does come with an inventory sheet, which, oh, and it's in baggies already. Yes, I really appreciate the inventory sheet. Tells you the ID and the quantity of each one. Doesn't tell you the DMC code, which is, I don't think, Unless 154 is that code. I was expecting some 310 and I don't see 310 on there. So it might be a different guide. And um, where is the one? So L is 939. Okay. So it is going to be that dark blue versus black, which is not like a, you know, a deal breaker for me. I just, for some reason, really like black. It, I just don't see, do you see 310 on here? I do not see 310. But those are, they do actually look like they're um, DMC coded. So there is that. I do like that has a quantity, has instructions, has a little visual. That's nice. So I really like um, that they're in baggies. I mean, it does have pluses and minuses. Some people like baggies and not but look at all those holy crap that is so many so many and that's going to be the background all along here um it's going to make it a little bit harder to show you the colors i'll just go through i don't think they're in any order anyway they're going to get out of order in baggies we got a really nice pink i'm interested in the symbols are interesting definitely you can tell like um, Ch Japanese, Japan, or Chinese symbols on there. I want to know which ones are glow in the dark. And I'm not sure how to how that's signified other than the arrow. And so 11, I'm trying to figure out. So the code here, whoops, the code like 3806 is probably, yes. So that's what you're looking for. Um, is 3806. So it doesn't have the symbol on it. So I might go ahead and just put, put the symbol really big on these so that I know. Um, got some really nice purples here. I'm really interested in 047. So I'm going to keep my eyes peeled for that. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, I love this color. This is like a nice dark blue slash purple that's 796 so let's see um yes I, I bet the glow in the dark hopefully it will just be able to tell um got some off whites i'm just gonna grab a bunch of these so we can see pinks i don't think there's any ab's in this kit um reds, lots of purples. The drill quality looks nice. Nothing wrong with the drills. 
Is that the one I need? So I need 047 and 195. 047 and 195. So I'm going to try to keep that in mind. As we're just looking at the colors, nice pink here, lots of shades of purple, orange, that yellow, 195. Okay, so the, it is an AB drill. That's what this is, is an AB drill. Look at how pretty. I love that color. It's going to pop. So that is symbol number S. So there's going to be ABs here, kind of sprinkled all throughout in here as well. Let's see. Got this really pretty blue. I think I see the other AB here. Oh, yeah. Look how pretty that is. Oh, it's going to be so good. I'm so excited. Um, got this dark purple, light purple, so many purples. If you're a purple fan, this kit's the one for you. Got that. It is glow in the dark. I don't know how to determine which one's glow in the dark. So we'll, we'll have to see with that. And then got, I love this color as well. Pinks. Yes. So I'll have to, I guess I'll have to just do a post review um, or maybe like a follow up when I get into this kit to see which one is glow in the dark. I, it might be K. That might be the one. But let me see if I can find K because it, I think it might be this. Three, eight, yes, yes. So this could be the glow in the dark. Like if I put, let me, let me see. It also has been in a box. So of course it won't have that glow in the dark effect either. The hearts, that would be cool if it was the heart one, but it doesn't really distinguish which one's glow in the dark. So I'll have to stay post, stay tuned. Um, I'm sure I'll be working on this kit at some point because I've been dying for this kit for a long time. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you are liking unboxings and you want more, um, diamond painting unboxings from me, please let me know. Like I'm trying to figure out what people like the most. I love doing unboxings. They're one of my favorite things to do. So let me know what you think. I'm trying to just kind of clean it up here and put it away for my rainy the day rainy day kit oh you know what one more thing i just wanted to show you guys the tool kit uh, the wax i remember from crafties not the best do not like the wax from crafties personal opinion right there the very basic boat uh does have a multi-placer which is nice basic pens with some squishies thank you so much have a good rest of your day bye Ciao.